Thousands of residents salvage what's left of their damaged homes amid Peru's worst flooding in decades. More than 80 people have been killed and tens of thousands displaced by weeks of torrential downpours, the result of a sudden and abnormal warming of Pacific waters off the country's coast. Many of the hardest hit are those who can least afford it, poor residents who built their homes on cheap land near the river. Since the rain started, we don't have anything to take out the water. There are mosquitoes, and the truth is, this brings a lot of sickness, especially for my youngest son. We want someone to help us take out the water. In the capital, Lima, where a third of Peruvians live, schools have been closed and tap water restricted after treatment systems were clogged. While rain totals have not exceeded Peru's El Nino in 1998, rain is falling at a faster rate, rapidly filling streets and rivers. The localized El Nino phenomenon causing these extreme weather conditions is expected to continue into April.